Have you ever heard the story of how ancient Indian alchemists claimed to turn ordinary metals into gold? It sounds like a legend, but what if there's more to it? What if their experiments were the foundation of something we still use today, modern chemistry? Picture this. Thousands of years ago, in small, smoke-filled chambers, alchemists practiced Rasa Shastra, the science of transformation. They weren't just chasing gold. They believed they were unlocking universal secrets. These weren't just experiments. They were rituals, blending science and spirituality. They thought if they could purify a metal, they could purify the soul too. One ancient text, the Rasanava, described processes like heating, distillation, and mixing chemicals, methods that sound remarkably like what chemists do today. How could they have understood such advanced techniques without any modern tools? That's the mystery. Here's where it gets even more fascinating. Their goal wasn't just wealth, it was immortality. They believed creating gold represented reaching a state of perfection for both matter and the human spirit. Gold wasn't just a metal, it was a symbol of enlightenment. And their experiments with mercury? Modern research has found that some of these mercury-based compounds are still used in Ayurveda today for healing and rejuvenation. But the most intriguing part, some texts hint at hidden formulas, secrets deliberately kept out of reach, fearing they could be misused. Could these lost recipes hold answers we're still searching for? Imagine if they understood things about chemical reactions that we're only beginning to rediscover. Here's something to think about. Alchemy wasn't just about changing metals. It was about transformation itself. Taking something ordinary and making it extraordinary. Isn't that what we all strive for in life? So, are these secrets truly lost? Or are they waiting for us to understand them again? If this story sparked your curiosity, subscribe to Universal Insights. Share this with someone who loves exploring the unknown, because together we might just uncover the greatest mysteries of all.